Salman, 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 guys. Uh, I get it. I get it. I heard you guys. I get it. You guys want gun content. Uh, <laughs> as I've been running away from focusing on guns because I don't want to be um, I don't want to be gun jack. The same way I've run away from focusing on content that's too heavy, Jim, or content that's too heavy in terms of just any specific area. Guys, I'm just a guy, you know, I'm a guy who works like people that are watching here, who has a relationship, who has ups and downs, who has kids, who... So again, the reason why I have set up this channel the way it is, is so that I can try and discuss different avenues and different areas of my life. However, it is a community, so I need to hear in the comments what you guys are looking for and a lot of the things a lot of the dms are guns 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 we want more guns what gun 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 you know so um again i went to my instagram probably about 30 different messages around guns um there's one that was done by Ustimbis and the way he broke it down and i was like geez this is actually amazing so thank you Ustimbis. so um essentially what i will do is that i will now try part of between me discussing relationships discussing the challenges that men go through the mental health that us guys face the the challenges that our sisters face a uh, gym health looking after yourself how to be a better father how to be a better partner besides that i'll also integrate uh, a a gun journey series uh, type of situation so in that what i want to try and and, and do is first take you through the steps of uh, the person that you need to become in order to get a gun you know it's not just uh let's wake up i saw a movie where they were shooting no 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 no. you need to be of sound mind you need to be ready mentally psychologically your ego needs to be out the door before you even consider uh, having a gun a gun are for people legal rational logical people who are there to protect themselves their families and their assets that's why we have a gun you know uh so i'm going to try and unpack and take you down the journey what are the first steps? Because people really, really struggle to understand or know rather the first step. I'm sitting at home. I don't know what to do. I don't know where to go. The first step. So what I'll do is that I'll go to different gun stores. I'll go to uh, different gun experts, just hearing their opinions, how to start. So I'll go to the police station. I've got a couple of friends of mine who are police officers. Again, around that process of getting that first step, your competency. What, what is that? What is getting your learner's license for a gun? Your competency, what, what are the tests involved? What are the steps? What are the practical tests? I'll go over different things like, again, which shooting range do I go to? You know, there's indoor shooting ranges. How are they different from outdoor shooting ranges? You know, um, what gun is best for home defense? What gun is best for me? You know, so there's different weapons, you know, which ones can I conceal? Which ones can't I conceal? I've heard about this AR-15 things in all these American uh, news outlets. What is that? What does that look like? Is it something that I can keep? Is it something that I can't keep? What's what's the best make? You know, do I get a Glock? Do I get uh, a, a SARS? Do I get a, you know, what, what, whatever the case may be, um, my job is to arm you with the right information around uh, uh, getting a gun in those steps. So what I'll speak about is, as, as I said, obtaining your, your license. I'll speak about the different types of guns, the different makes of guns. I'll speak about the different price ranges, um, the different compact, because there's different sizes, guys. You know, there's some big guns, you know, Desert Eagle, and then the smaller compact guns that we've seen, you know, those little cranny, those movies where the cranny pulls it out of a purse, you know, what's the best on you based on, again, your likes, what suits you, the, the recoil that you are looking for type of energy. Um, how many guns you can have, the regulation, the law. I'll bring in friends of mine who are lawyers and police officers that understand the law. When can I shoot a person? I want to know when can I shoot someone? You know, again, we'll break that down within the legal uh, 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 frame. Uguti, this is when you're allowed to defend yourself and neutralize a, 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 a criminal. And these are the times where you cannot and you will get into serious trouble should you do this. This is when your gun um, needs to get pulled out. This is when it's not supposed to get pulled out. Guys, things like gun safety. Very, 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 very important. What type of safe? You know, I've got three kids, little kids, eight, six, and four. 
864. Yes. Ah, Jesus. So I've got little kids. So that to me is huge. You know, yes, I might have my weapon on my side right now, but that doesn't mean it stays here 24 7. It stays in the safe, locked away in the safe. And when it's not in the safe, it's on my person. That's the, that's the rules. I can't just, oh, let's leave it on the kitchen counter while I'm busy chopping onions. No, that's not how it works. You know, and again, um, what, what does that look like? Carrying a gun is very intimidating, not just for the person who's carrying and training, but for people around you. You know, now you're at a bride and people are like, hey, that guy's carrying a gun. It's intimidating. Why is he carrying a gun? It's scary. You know, all those type of things. I will walk you through all of those things. And then one that I've been hearing over and over and over over again is sisters that I want to carry a gun. Yo, guys, our sisters are fucking tired of being victimized. Our sisters are fucking tired of being abused. Our sisters are tired of being raped, being murdered by jerks, by criminals, by losers, by... Mm, they are tired. So they're like, okay, shop. If the law can't protect me, if you men can't keep it in your pants and behave like a human being, sure attack me try to rape me and see if i don't defend my life try to victimize me to a point where i will be found in a fucking uh in stamkok stamkok train somewhere i will defend my life there's many single single mothers out there that are looking after one or two kids that are scared at night when they hear the the, the tree brushing against the window they panic because they're like I might get raped, my kids might get trafficked, worse, my kids might get killed in front of me, whatever the case may be. So once we discuss that, I'll have a huge section around women legally carrying firearms to protect themselves and to protect their loved ones. What type of firearm is best suited for women? It's not what you think. I know a lot of you guys are thinking certain things, sexist stereotype. It's actually gonna shock you when I start showing you the different types that I would recommend and I know the experts would recommend for females, you know, for women um, that, that, that actually want to get into this. Guys, I will take you through step by step by step by step what you need to work on. I've heard you guys, I've heard it. You know, I've heard um, the, the, hey, make more gun content. Hey, make more la la la. Again, as I'm saying, there's more to me than just being guns. You know, I wanna talk, I wanna have a, a um, one way I talk about rugby, you know. I want one way I talk about I don't know, social media. I want one where I talk about love and what love looks like. There's more to me. I'm not just a person who's going to start a vlog and just only talk about one thing because I'm trying to create view or get views or whatever the case is. Guys, this is a community. You know, there's different people. Not everybody wants to hear about guns the same way that not everybody wants to hear about the mental challenges that our men are going through. I, who started this channel, want to discuss everything that is bothering me in my world. I'm not a gun guy, I'm a gun, I'm a guy that happens to have a gun. I'm a father who happens to have a gun. I'm a partner who happens to have a gun. I'm a this who happens to have a gun. I'm, it, the gun is not me, it's a part of me. The same way you might have a butter knife in your drawer that doesn't really talk about who you are. You might be good at singing and twerking. That doesn't necessarily mean that's who you are. It's part of who you are. So I will continue making different content based on whatever topic that I feel is, is important for me and the community on the day. But I'm, I'm still very, very cognizant that it is a community where you guys in the comments are busy saying, we would like more of this content. We would like more of this content. We've met. There's so many topics that I haven't hit yet that people have asked me, whether it's my Instagram DMs or whether it's comments here around me want them wanting me to cover certain points. And I'll get to those guys. I promise you I will. Some I'm not too fair and I just want to do a bit of research around it before I just come and blah, 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 blah in front of you. Um, others, it's just being on the back burner. Um, but I will get to it. So for now, I'm just letting you guys know I will do more gun content and again the gun content is all about family it's all about uh, uh, within the legal frameworks it's all about making sure that you protect your loved ones it's not about guys who are trying to it's not about guys who are trying to be cool it's not about guys who are, have an ego whatever the case is no it's about safety it's about our brothers and our sisters who are tired of being victims in today's society our brothers and our sisters who are, are, are scared at night because they know Guti. There are criminals that are waiting at any at any time to take uh, advantage of them. I am pro guns used in a legal, logical, rational way to protect life. That's when I'm there to talk about guns. So I'll hold your hand. I'll take you through the steps. 
I'll advise if you're within, if you're in Johannesburg, I'll show you different ranges. If you're not, I'll maybe talk about ones that I know uh, where I'm from in KZN. I'll talk about this. I'll talk about that. Keep writing on the comments. I, I might not get to responding to as many as I'd like, but I do see them and I do jot them down. So I have an Excel spreadsheet where I write certain pointers down when I get them from comments. So I really do appreciate that. So guys, be patient with me. Let's start this journey for those that want. Uh, for those that um, are a bit nervous, a little bit, just listen. Something I'll, or something I might say might uh, tickle your fancy. And then again, just know, Giantanda, I want nothing but the best for you. I want this community to grow. I want us to love each other. Please share this video, like, subscribe, comment, hit that notification bell. Apparently, it really, really does help. Giantanda, share this far and wide. Have yourselves a fantastic day. Sure.